Yo, what's up ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy and today I have a very, very special video for you guys. Now with this special video, I have to admit something to you, we've been lying. The truth is, it's your scientist isn't really a real scientist, or at least he wasn't a real scientist. You see, if you want to become a real scientist, you have to apply with the University of Scientists or the College Science of in Amsterdam, New Oregon. And once you get the application in, it takes a long time for it to get approved. So we've been waiting and waiting. And that's not to say ITSY Scientist doesn't have all the necessary knowledge to teach you guys about science, but it's a big thing to get verified by the College of Science in New Hampshire, Oregon. Texas. And the other day, a special package came in the mail to the Albo House, and It's Your Scientist finally got approved by the College of Science in New Oregon, New Hampshire, Texas, and he is now a real scientist. So, ladies and gentlemen, please scroll on down and smash that thumbs up button for the new, the improved, the official It's Your Scientist. I'm an official scientist. As you can tell, I'm in a really good mood because I'm an official scientist, baby. Yo, Chad, I made it, baby. I made it. I'm a scientist. All right, let's get into the video. Okay, so for today's video, we are going to be doing the Do Not Microwave Challenge, but we're not doing one thing. We're not doing two. We're not even doing three. We are going to be microwaving all of these items plus the egg. Hopefully I don't burn anything down, but these all should make some really, really cool reactions when you put them in the microwave. So as some of you original Itsy Scientist fans will know, we have done the ivory soap in the past. Now I know there's a lot of new viewers here, so I figured we would do the classic to start things off and get your palate wet for some of the science experiments to come. How's that sound, Jeff? Very good. Plus, this is the easiest one and I think the least dangerous. So it's always good to start. This Come one's on. the least dangerous? Yeah. Bruh. Look, Jad, I just want to say I appreciate you always putting your life in danger for Itsy Scientist videos. Being Bro. a cameraman, it's not an easy job and you do it like a champ. So Especially thanks. these microwave looking at, fire looking at. So the key here is to use ivory soap. Basically, the difference between ivory soap and regular soap is it has these like air pocket bubble things inside of it, which creates a really cool effect when you put it in the microwave. And let's get started with the very first science experiment. Safety first, guys. Ow. All right. Bam. Here, I got it, Jed. You hide. I've got the protective gear. <laughs> oh. oh. It's coming. It's happening. Oh. Look at that, guys. Holy shit. It's like erupting out of the sides of the soap. Isn't that crazy? As you can see, it inflates when it's in the microwave, and then as soon as you take it out, it kind of deflates a little bit. Oh, it's hard. Yeah. It kind of feels like paper mache. That's what I likened it to. So that's the first experiment, guys. This is a really easy one you guys can do at home. It's just ivory soap. That's the only thing you got to make sure you have. It's not dangerous either, which is, um, I can't say the same for the rest of these experiments. So let's get into the rest of them. Alrighty, it's your scientist. What's next? <laughs> <laughs> You're such an eager learner, Jad. I love that. All right, let's get on to the second experiment, which is the bag of chips, guys. So basically, any bag of chips should do fine. 
you just put it in the microwave and turn the microwave on. It's really, really simple. These experiments are super simple. They can be dangerous though. Make sure you don't leave it in for too long and be careful when you're touching it. All right, let's pop this open. Throw the Cheetos bag in. No magic going on here. Jad? I got you, I got you're you. You're good? Yeah. How sick is that? How Yo, hey! That? What the hell? Yo! Look at bruh. it. <laughs> Definitely bruh. smells a little burnt. That's a don't try this at home. <laughs> Yo, do not try that at home. <laughs> Alright, so here guys is the shrunken Cheetos bag post microwaving. It was, that was a full size Cheetos bag. And look at the back. You can still read nutrition facts. What's a serving? Like, it maintains the integrity of the bag and what was on the bag. It just, honey, I shrunk the kids face ass the bag. That's all it does. That's weird, bro. I've never seen a potato chip bag shrink down like that before, bro. bro that was insanity. Only on the Itsy Scientist episodes, you get to see some cool shit. Like, I mean, it might be other place on YouTube too, but like, all five? Just here, just here. This is a banger, especially for you guys. Yeah, toss this with the other ones. Leave a little pile. Oh, oh, I like that. All right, next up, we are gonna be doing a CD, okay? Tell me nothing crazy happens with the CD, bro. I mean, nothing like too crazy. <laughs> if sparks are flying, fam, I'm jetting the kitchen. You're with a certified scientist now, man. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Yo, Albo fam, send you that shit in the mail. <laughs> True. Thank you, AlboFam. I forgot to mention that earlier, actually. A big shout out to AlboFam for this. AlboFam actually was the one responsible for expediting the process at the science college and uh, making everything go a little bit faster. So shout out to AlboFam. All right. So for this experiment, just put like a mug in here. Bro, DJ, I don't know if you want to see this, fam. <laughs> You're going to tilt this right on the side there so that you can see what's happening because this is where the reaction is going to occur. For this one, I'm gonna put my goggles on. Where are my goggles at? Oh. <laughs> this guy's a, saying you're a certified scientist, Hey, dude. look, I'm a human too, okay? Just just because I'm a scientist doesn't mean I can't make mistakes once in a while and burn the house down. I'll hold this. You, you can step back, my friend. All right. <whistles> Set it for 15 seconds. <laughs> Yo, okay. <laughs> okay. That's a quick one. You cannot leave that in for long. All right, guys. So uh, well, that, as you okay. can see, you it got murked real quick. I think it was in there for like six, seven seconds. Smell not great right now, but as you saw right when it turns on, there's this like crazy ring of light that shoots around the CD. It's really, really cool. Definitely do not do this at home. I want to reiterate that. Are you okay, Jeff? Yep. You're good? But you're saying it only gets crazier from here, right? Yeah, kinda. <laughs> so for the second last experiment, we are gonna be using Christmas lights. Now this might be the most dangerous, but it's not as messy as the final one. So that's why I'm doing this fourth. I don't even know how to explain this to you guys. I just want to put it in and show you guys. Put it in there. How are you feeling about this one, Jeff? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> You're so skeptical. I'm a real scientist now. You should trust me. You didn't even know how to put on your goggles it's like properly on three minutes ago. <laughs> so that has nothing to do with the science experiment. That just means my motor skills are lacking. Uh, <laughs> Bongo's here too now, so he'll, he'll uh, help us. This is a horrible idea, but I believe in it's a scientist, so it is what it is. Yeah, I Go believe in shit. Like, I love that. <laughs> All right, guys. Let's put these in. Okay, we're gonna do this one. Jad is filming some additional behind the scenes, so if you wanna see that, go check him out. I'll leave a link in the description. Well, that showed you though. Let's see what happens. All right, I'm gonna put this in for legit five seconds. Quick loss, all right? This, I'm, I'm nervous about this one. I'm gonna be real with you guys. <laughs> you see that? Bro, that's Ooh, so shit, sick! Shit, Tell me that's shit, not shit, so sick! It was lit! It was lit! It was lit! Let's go! I think 
think five seconds is the perfect amount of time. Let's see what happened. Yo, honestly? It's not that bad. It's not bad. Yo, that worked flawlessly. I think if you leave them in a little bit longer, that's when shit starts to really pop off. The light bulbs are warm. But other than that, like, I don't think you'd be able to tell I just microwave these. <laughs> There, see, I told you to trust me. All right, all I right. I told you to trust me. You're right. Bongo, man. Bongo, Bongo trust me. I did not fucking trust you. Yeah. <laughs> all right. That's four experiments up. Nothing burned down. So we're we're doing well so far. Time for the final experiment. I mean, I'm not even going to add that to the pile over there because it just looks like Christmas lights. Now. <laughs> Doesn't even look special. Maybe we should burn it. Oh, uh, yeah, let's go to the experiment number the next five. One? Yeah, yeah, sure? yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. All right, guys. Experiment number five involves an egg. Very simple household item. What do you think is going to happen? <laughs> Based off you saying it's going to be messy, uh, I assume an, a small Argentinian soccer player is going to come out of that thing and exactly. start fucking shooting Just around. Just megging everyone. Exactly. Yeah. All right. Yo, hey. I'm um, cheese, nothing happened. Maybe I gotta do it for longer? Another one! <laughs> All right, we're putting this one in for a minute. Let's see what happens now. Oh, I see something happening. Something's happening. Oh shit. Oh shit. It's cracked, but, oh. You guys can see a little Argentinian soccer player did not come out, but it did get messy. I'm not gonna lie, I was worried that wasn't gonna work for a little bit, but it worked and uh, it worked even better than I was expecting. That was a legit explosion. Not bad, eh? Not bad. At not all. bad. Where'd Jad go? Who's cleaning that one though? You. What? <laughs> 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 yeah, come look. Get closer, it's okay. Bro, it full blown cooked it. It, ex it cooked it and then it exploded. It just smells like eggs. Yeah, it's not bad. But you like eggs that are salted and peppered somehow. It smells good. <laughs> you some shit in there? Try to eat some. Oh, fuck you, eat some. <laughs> All right, guys. I know at the beginning of the video, I told you I was going to be doing five experiments, but I got a special sixth experiment in store for you guys. Basically, what I'm going to do is take everything that we microwaved today, put it all in the microwave at once. Sounds like a good idea, eh, Jeff? You actually think it's a good idea? I'm surprised. I like that. He finally trusts me. No! It's okay. a bad idea. I was trying to shake it. I was trying to shake it. Too late! Alright, first thing, CD. Second thing, soap. Fuck the wrapper. Chips? Eh, nah, we'll leave the bag. Same lights as before? Oh, well, lights. And... Let's just put the whole thing in. You're a savage. Alright. Are you sure you want to do this, bro? Why not? All right, I'll see you guys in 45 seconds or if the house starts to explode. A few moments later. Five, Nothing's exploding four, yet. three, Let's see what happens. two, Let's see what one. Happens. Oh shit! What the? It's a taquito! I knew it! I knew it, man. Whenever you combine a whole bunch of things, a taquito comes out. That's just how it works, man. Oh. oh. <laughs> I think some of the CD that was in there is in the taquito now. I don't know what it is about me and taquitos. They just seem to always just... Find you. They find me because I love them. <laughs> you know what, Sean? I'm proud of you. You didn't burn the house down, bro. I didn't. I didn't even set off an alarm. You, you, gained, you gained some uh, it's a scientist points in my books. I did? Yeah. yeah. You know why? Why is that? Because I'm a real scientist now. From here on out, nothing bad is going to happen when I do science experiments. This is a certified badge from the Science Commission in New Hampshire, Oregon, Texas. That's why. <laughs> Alright <laughs> right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Also, go check out Jad's channel for behind the scenes and also gotta give him a shout out for filming all this dangerous shit that I do because, like I said, it's dangerous and he puts his life in danger. You know what guys, I think Sean needs to get me an Itzy assistant 
lab coat and glasses as well so I can be prepared. So if you want that to be done, make sure to comment it down below or maybe just hit that thumbs up button. That sounds like a great idea. I would be very down to show Jad some science experiments so that maybe next time he's a little less nervous while I'm conducting my own experiments. As always, thank you guys so much for watching and I will catch you next time. Toodles!